So I have the Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 right here. And today I'm going to show you how to boot this smartphone into recovery mode. And we first start that by powering off the device. If you're in Android, you can bring up the power menu to turn it off. If you're in a boot loop or anything like that, you can just press and hold the power button for about 15 to 20 seconds, and then eventually you'll see the device power off. While you are in a powered down state, this is when you want to press and hold the power button and then the volume up buttons. We're going to press these two buttons down at the same time and we're going to continue to hold these buttons down even past this splash screen until we get to this menu. And as you just saw, it was at a menu previous to booting into this menu and that's because I just didn't let go of the power and volume button at the same time. It's very common and all we have to do is press the volume down button to highlight the back to main menu option and then press the power button to select it and then that brings us to the main menu for the Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 recovery mode which right now is set to Redmi Recovery 3.0 so there are a couple of things that we can do in the stock recovery mode. Now if you install a custom recovery like TWRP, then doing that is going to boot you into TWRP. Since we just have the stock software installed, it's booting us into this main menu where we're actually not able to do anything with taps, just like Android's stock recovery. We have to use the volume buttons to control what option is highlighted. And then we press a power button to select the option that is highlighted. So like I said, there's a couple things we can do here. If you're having a boot loop issue, one of the first things that I recommend is doing a factory data reset by wiping data, which we can do here by pressing the power button. Or you can actually connect this to Xiaomi's PC suite by highlighting the Mi Assist option and pressing the power button. And there you can see it's wanting us to connect our smartphone to the PC with a USB cable. And then we should be opening up Xiaomi's PC or Mi PC suite. So while you are in the Redmi Recovery 3.0 software to boot back into Android because you may have accidentally booted into Xiaomi's recovery mode by accident. If you have a case on that's pressing on these buttons, have the phone in your pocket in a certain way that's pressing on those buttons, even just holding the phone tightly, you can easily press those two buttons. So if you find yourself in recovery mode, the first thing is to try is to highlight the reboot option press the power button to select that option and then by default the top option reboot to system is going to be highlighted so we're just going to keep that option highlighted press the power button to select it and that's going to reboot our Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 smartphone if everything is working properly this is going to boot us right into the Android operating system However, I know sometimes that you may be in a boot loop, and if that's the case, then that may reboot you back into the Redmi recovery that we were just at in that main menu. And again, if that's the case, then I definitely recommend trying to do a factory data reset and then rebooting into Android. So there you have it. That is how to boot the Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 into recovery mode as well as how to get out of recovery mode if you find yourself if you find your your device has booted into it by accident